The Big E, it's a Massachusetts day on this Thursday. I was lucky enough to go to the fair opening day, so it only made sense that my co-anchor Chris would have his chance to go down and enjoy the fair. He joins us now live with more. Hey, Chris. Hey, Jordan. Yeah, wrapping up the first full week of the fair here in Western Mass. As you mentioned, today is Massachusetts Day, a day dedicated to the Bay State, but it's especially poignant here for us in Western Mass because today there was also a ceremony for a much beloved and local restaurant tour from Western Mass. Western Mass News reporter Jordan McCool has more on a special ceremony held for the late Andy Yee. A permanent remembrance to our friend Andy Yee. <laughs> The plaque at the Eastern States Exposition now hangs in honor of the late Andy Yee. Yee was a managing partner of the family's Bean Restaurant Group and was well known for his work in saving multiple restaurants in downtown Springfield and surrounding areas. A visionary, a leader, and the best friend one could ever hope for. Governor Charlie Baker making a stop at the Big E, saying a few heartfelt words. But I am so grateful that I get to know this guy over the course of my time here on Earth. He's really special. Getting emotional, the governor says Yi was always positive. He was literally one of those people who could create joy in almost any setting and under any circumstance. And he did it time and time again for every single minute that he was on Earth. The plaque is located at the Worst House attraction, which Yi established at the fairgrounds. The 17-day event that Andy so loved. Everyone knows that Andy would always go big, and that's why he loved the Big E so much. He died just a week shy of his 60th birthday. Local and state leaders ended the dedication with the cheers to his life and the legacy he leaves behind. For Western Mass News, I'm Jordan McCool.